All right, what's Rosetta Tavares here doing um, the final installment, maybe, of our, our rank series. Um, and this one covers Grandmaster. I wasn't going to do this one at all, um, but kind of Brian, Brian maybe talked me into it a little bit. It, it really probably didn't take much talking into, but we're, we're going to go for it anyway. So we give you the short answer in that a Grandmaster is somebody who, in Setefaris anyway, has reached the, the rank of 8th degree, black belt and above. Um, to me, it's more than just a belt. You know, a belt is a piece of cloth. You know, it, the, the belt itself... Is it's just a piece of cloth, um, but to me, you know, from from my experience with the grandmasters, uh, Bert Nelson and Joe, um, they are somebody who is a scream wise um, has reached just a extremely high level of technical ability and knowledge in, in the art. It's much more than that though. Um, there, that's also somebody with, you know, a lot of life experience that they, you know, and they, they really mentored me a lot, um, and helped me through life experiences that I otherwise probably would not have had help with. Um, so just to kind of, I'm just kind of going to leave it at that. Um, so Grandmaster in Siete Paras is one, somebody who has reached uh, the low, uh, the rank of 8th degree and higher. Um, they have uh, just an, I don't want to say incomprehensible level of knowledge because they comprehend it. Sometimes I don't, but, you know, their, their level of knowledge is, is just so far past mine. Um, that it, it's really amazing and third they they act as mentors to people they have that exceptional life experiences and they help guide people through personal problems and issues so that's a grandmaster in my opinion